Scott Dorval. My name is Reese. I go to Central Elementary. And my question is, why are there so many tornadoes in Oklahoma? Reese from Central Elementary in Napa went to speak to the kids today, and that was a great question. Why so many in Oklahoma? Well, if you look at this chart here, he's absolutely right. The frequency of tornadoes, the very high category, the red right here, North Central Oklahoma, Oklahoma City. Boy, I tell you, you got a lot of tornadoes right here in the center part of Oklahoma. And the reason for it, you need three main elements to get tornadoes to form. And in this part of Tornado Alley, there are these elements come together, together, together better than any place in the entire world because of the way we're set up. First of all, you need warm, moist air coming in from the south. So we get warm, moist air, and it comes in from the south right out of the Gulf of Mexico in these southerly winds. So you have this moisture. That's one of the main reasons we don't get tornadoes as many here in the northwest. We do get moisture coming in from the tropics, and that's why our tornado frequency goes up in July and August. But there's the warm, moist air from the south. You need a cold front with jet stream energy coming in from the north and so over the land you get that cool flow of air coming in not so much so over the pacific northwest that's why the least amount of tornadoes are here so that comes in from the north but there's one element that you need you need dry air in the middle of the atmosphere right in the middle that makes the atmosphere go destabilized it causes tornadoes to form and so when you get air rushing over the rockies and then it sinks into the great plains it dries out and that comes in in the middle levels and that's why all of those elements come together right here in the center part of the country and it causes big issues the month of may is when tornado alley fires up the most and so that's why you have to watch it here in the northwest when we do get the tornadoes it's typically june and july when the monsoons come in actually it's more towards july and august here for us this probably should uh, say july and august uh, for later in the season so great question from reese from uh, central elementary school in napa another question coming up about the northern lights in my special weather segment